Dillon with Front Doors News and today I have special guest Executive Chef Nephi Craig from Sunrise Park Resort. You are going to be the chef for their 30th annual Silver and Tortoise Ball which benefits the Phoenix Indian Center, correct? Yes, that's correct. Great, and that event's going on in April, so what can um, everybody expect from this event? Um, well, we're going to be doing a featuring Native American food or Native American cuisine. Uh, we've got different ingredients from all over the, the country and the menu is structured to um, showcase different tastes and flavors of regions throughout the Americas. Oh wow, very cool. Now you founded the Native American Culinary Association. Can you tell us a little bit about that? Um, the Native American Culinary Association was founded on a really basic idea. Um, Fourteen years ago when I first stepped into culinary school, it was uh, automatically obvious that there was a lack of um, information or just general knowledge from anybody, students and chefs alike. Um, so that, that, that initial feeling of alienation um, kind of stayed with me and eventually when I got enough confidence and training, just went ahead and went public and started it. So Very cool. It's awesome. And you were telling me earlier you have a bit of French cuisine background as well. Yeah, well, uh, classically trained um, through culinary school and then um, worked at the Country Club at DC Ranch when it first opened way in the beginning. Mm -hmm. And then after that I was able to work at Mary Lane's at the Phoenician. Um, and that coupled with the Native American Culinary Association concept um, ultimately launched me to four different countries in the world. So. Wow, world traveler here. Yeah. So what kind of menu are you, we going to be having at the Silver and Twelve Base Ball? Um, we just came from the tasting and they're going to do um, a Western Apache charred pork solder pasoli. Um, so it's a take on a, like a Pueblo, New Mexico favorite. Um, there's a small subtitle on the menu that says a, a raiding campaign recipe um, because we were Apaches and they have a long history of raiding and warfare. So mm -hmm. we raided for that recipe. So oh, in, wow. In a way. So um, that's the first course. They're going to do a quinoa salad, um, a respectful nod to South America and the superfood quinoa. Mm -hmm. which um, fortified millions of people in South America. Oh, wow. Um, so then we're going to go back up into North America with the Great Plains and hit the, hit the, uh, the, the Great Plains with bison, uh, representing the, the, the people there. Mm -hmm. And then we got a very nice special um, dessert called Pear Bigoa. It means um, the Pear's house in Apache. I love Pear's. So, yeah. Awesome. Um, it's, it's really nice, really elegant and flavorful. Really cool. It sounds like it. Very diverse. It sounds like you got a great meal all set up for there. You have some good wine pairing with it as well? Yeah, what's, uh, what we'll do is work through that and make sure that everything gets paired appropriately. Um, I think they want to take their time in doing that. Mm -hmm. um, some of the flavors, um, they, they will go well. So it's going to be really neat to see what they ultimately decide on. Um, the first step today was choosing the menu. Um, we're, I know I'm very excited about it. I'm excited to just hear about it. I'm making my tummy growl here. <laughs> right. Yeah. Well, thank you so much again mm -hmm. for joining us today, Nephi. We appreciate it. All right. For taking the time to share all of your wonderful food knowledge. Thanks for joining us today at Front Doors News.